The FDA is likely to authorize a COVID vaccination for children under the age of five by the middle of June. On June 12th, the FDA already published its review of Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine information. The report indicated that the Pfizer vaccine is effective for children under the age of five and does not appear to raise any safety concerns. A similar report was published just before that about Moderna's vaccine for younger children. On June 15th, the FDA's panel of advisors will convene to review the vaccine information for these younger children. It's gonna look at that Moderna vaccine at the same time. If approved, this would be the first time a vaccine is available for the youngest age group, those age six months old, up to age five. And remember, vaccines and boosters right now are widely available for anybody age five and older. Now, at the same time as the FDA was taking some of its steps to review the data produced by Pfizer and Moderna, the White House started rolling out a vaccination plan for these younger children. They said they believed the vaccines to be authorized by the FDA soon and started preparing the vaccine distribution and the messaging for the state's providers and localities. And they said the Biden administration has already made 10 million doses available to states and providers, with about 85% of the children in this younger age group living within five miles of a vaccination site. Now it is about 18 million children that fall into that under age five category that aren't yet eligible for a COVID vaccine, but could very soon become eligible. Current rates of hospitalization and death for children under five are higher than those for children age 5 through 17, highlighting the importance of getting a vaccine into the hands of these younger children sooner rather than later. To find a vaccine or booster close to you, we link to vaccines.gov in the description below. We also share more information from the FDA and White House.